Hello, Namaste, Salam Walekum, Sastriyakal. Welcome back to another session with your washer at Vareva.com. Today I want to show you how to make Palak Pakoda. You know, this is very easy to make. Here I've got Bombay Basin, which is uh, nice, fine and uh, pretty good. For one cup of uh, basin, add half a cup of uh, rice flour and a uh, pinch of hing will give a very nice uh, flavor to your uh, pakoda. And also add uh, salt. You know, spinach has got a lot of salt in it, so add a little less salt. Add uh, turmeric, ajwain, that is a uh, carom seeds. And this is optional crushed coriander seeds. Add in this. And mix all of these ingredients nicely. And we are going to add water and make a nice batter. Now, add some oil on this. One teaspoon should be good enough. And then add water and make into a thick paste first. When you make a thick paste, then all the lumps will be gone. Then you can add a little extra water and make into a batter. Now look at this. Once you make this into a thick paste, there won't be any lumps. So this is a simple technique, you know, that whenever you make any batters, first make like a paste and then add extra water later. Take spinach leaves and uh, pour this batter on top of this. You know, mix this along with this batter. Now look at this leaves, nicely coated with the batter. Now we are going to fry them. Now just uh, drop these leaves of spinach in the uh, hot oil. Some people like these leaves to be slightly crushed. Some people like the big leaves to be put. It's up to you. However you want, you can make it. That should be good enough. Do not add too much of uh, the spinach into the oil. Just uh, let it have enough room to fry and become crispy. Once they are fried nice and crispy, transfer them onto a paper towel so that all the extra oil is uh, removed. A good pakoda needs a good chutney. But these pakodas are so good that you don't need any chutney. Especially the spinach with these kind of pakodas is excellent. Everybody loves it. And dear friends, make it the way I showed you. This is very easy to make and the most tastiest. Mmm, nice and crunchy, fantastic, ha, huh. wow, you know, in couple of years, probably Sanjay Thumma will be the only guy, probably I should even enter Guinness Book of Records of the number of dishes that he has eaten on the show. Dear friends, I hope you have enjoyed today's session, but do not forget, Varava is all about inspiring others to cook. So please post your recipes and cooking tips at wareva.com so others can benefit from your great cooking. Thank you.